Not me trying to get everybody to go carve pumpkins and they're roping instead. It is Saturday morning, y'all. I'm gonna preface this video with saying I'm trying some new settings on my camera to, they're playing Big Buck Hunter over here to match up with the new software that I have because I figured out that the videos were too big and that's why it was taking my internet so long to upload them. So let me know how all this looks uh, when you see this video. Okay, uh, I think it was Tracy that wanted to know how this was working out. I absolutely love it, y'all. It would take me like, <laughs> don't look at this situation, but I had all my peels, all my vitamins over here. And it would take me like five minutes to get them all out and put back and everything in the morning um, to like take my vitamins. And now I just go boop, beep, boop it a bop and pour this out. <laughs> Here comes the farmer. He's gonna be like, why are you talking about your vitamins? Um, pour it out, take my vitamins, stick this back in and then you're done. And um, I just keep it right on top of the fridge. And then hopefully when I get a little more time, I can get all this cleaned off and it won't be so um, messy over here anymore. So I totally recommend this. I will link this in um, home. Is that? What do you need down with it? I think, oh, you don't have to do it right now. No, but just show me. I'll show you in a second. Uh, it's linked, I'll link it in home, housewares, home, whatever that section is. I can't, I don't even know why I'm trying to talk to y'all right now because you know you can't hear me. Um, and then I'll link it below too. Totally love this. Okay. I gotta go show the farm or something. We are, <laughs> oh my gosh, this is too much going on right now. I'm trying to go ride my bike this morning before I take Koi to lessons. Is that a, oh, that's, I thought that was a covers. moose. This is, um. I thought there were covers. No, you had to buy the cover separate. This is the ball we got for Kate and Sassy too. I think Craig is gonna blow that up. Um, anyway, I got lots to show you, but right now I need to go show this, 40 inches. I don't know if it's as big as the one. Like that tall. How the hell was the one that they oh, had? That other one was huge. Well, this one costs enough money. You don't even want to buy one bigger than this. Anyway, for Cade, and then I'm going to go show him we are having our banquet um, next weekend. I got to put all this away to y'all. I washed a million dishes yesterday. The banquet we are having um, next week, I want to use my milk can that's outside with a bunch of sunflowers for our kind of farmhouse theme. Anyway, I'm not showing you my face because I look terrible, but I'm going to go show him where I want that cut and then we'll catch up very soon after I ride my bike. Okay, Quizzy is ready for basketball. Here we go. You want to show your new basketball shoes? Oh. Can we see them? I can't tell. SDSU blue and yellow okay i am feeling like this new setting has me really cropped and it's kind of like feels like shaky i don't know we'll see if 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 i do this whole video and it gets uploaded and i don't like it i'm just gonna go back to what i was doing anywho just have this walmart sweatshirt on that i love so much in this teal color i just got some olive walmart like joggers on i'm super comfy today we are going to some fun things tonight so i will probably Wait, like change costume yeah i will probably like chain and put some fun halloween stuff on tonight but um right now we got to take him to basketball you want to show him your costume room yeah you got to fill that he's got to do his water bottle no just bring it over here honey because this a whole thing is so shaky i don't want you running around with it um i don't know if i love this setting y'all i feel like this is how i used to do it before i got the new camera anyway we got the pants we dyed them yesterday we cut the top off does it match? It looks better than really it did good. anyway. And he just tucks the top like into the pants. Y'all, this has been the Halloween costume nightmare. Anyway, um, I'm hoping to get their Halloween pictures taken tonight like I always do and then I hang them. How does this look when I walk around, y'all? Ugh, I don't like it. Um, you know, I hang the pictures up here. I always do it in, this, in front of the same red barn and it looks so fun. Anyway, we gotta get that done tonight. We gotta carve pumpkins. We gotta make Halloween cookies. We're going to that fun thing tonight. What fun thing? You're going with Daddy. Oh, yeah. Me and Mary are going to like a haunted, it's not a haunted house. It's like, maybe I told you about this. It's at, um. Haunted Hollow. It's called, um. Haunted Hollow. Yeah, Haunted Hollow, but it's like a, um. Wait, no, that's a book. I just said that. I don't know what it's called. Anyway, it is, um. Are we thinking of the Headless Horseman? Yeah. It is a, um. No, I am. Haunted thing you walk through, and Koi does. He wants to go, but I'm thinking that's a bad idea. So him and Craig are gonna go to the pumpkin patch and do the corn maze in the dark. And I think there's bouncy houses and stuff. So we're gonna do all of that tonight. We've got a big morning first. It's and, gonna be um, so fun. Um, um, one of our relatives, um, they um went to the 
pumpkin patch at night and somebody with a hood scared them. And I Who chased out at them. Um, Ben's mom. Who's Ben? Our relative? Er, no, I forgot. A friend? Mm-hmm. <laughs> anyway, that sounds terrifying. Okay. So, uh, and basketball now, fun. and then we'll catch up in a little bit. Yeah, it's gonna be so fun. <laughs> okay, y'all, I have dropped Koisy off and then gone to the Quick Star. Um, it's kind of a new thing around here anyway. Uh, and they have like really good donuts. Um, and I promised my Sunday school class for tomorrow that we would do like a party and play games because I don't know if you remember, but I do like a poster and they put little stickers on and everybody had gotten to, um, I think five is what the goal was. Uh, everybody finally got to five, so we're gonna have a little party tomorrow. So I got donuts. I'll show you when we get home. It's back there. And I got puff corn and I got cheesy popcorn and pretzels. And I thought we could make like a little, I'll bring like little cup, cups and they can do like a little snack mix and have with the donuts. I did forget to get drink, but they could always just do water. I don't know. I might be out and about later and I uh, could get that. But I did get, um, trying to drink some water and I forgot my water bottle. So I just got some electrolyte water. Electrolyte water. And then they had this. Those quick trips are like, or quick stars. Is it quick trip or quick star? Whatever. It's like a little supermarket. It's amazing. Anyway, they have really good sushi there. But I thought 10 o'clock in the morning, Ailey, you don't need sushi. Anyway, I grabbed one of these full fulfill, fulfill bars. I don't know. I've never had one before. Have I? Maybe I have. I've tried a lot of keto stuff. It's hard to remember. But it's chocolate, peanut butter, caramel. I don't know. I just wanted a little something because I had a piece of toast for breakfast and I was starving. So. I'm gonna enjoy that. I'm gonna try to reply to comments uh, from my last video. Um, that didn't go up to like noon on Friday, y'all, because I didn't realize that when I was like rendering these big videos, it was only taking 12 minutes, which I was like, I guess this is so nice, because before it was taking so long. But the files were like 200 gigabytes, and it was taking like forever to upload them, and I thought it was my internet, but it was the videos. So that's what happened there. Um, I don't know. It's all a learning process. I'm just trying to like figure it all out. So that's what's happening. What else is happening? Did I tell you everything else? Oh, I got some pillows in for the craft room for like the little bench that I'm trying to do. In fact, I don't think I showed y'all um, that I had gotten a bench like seat, like a, a, a cushion, a bench cushion. I think I only showed it on Instagram, but it was the wrong color green and it was really puffy and I didn't like it and I kind of was like what should I do should I get a yellow one because the green wasn't working and most of you voted and I agreed to do pillows instead so I got this super cute little throw pillows to put like over on that bench area in my mending room and then just kind of like add holiday pillows to go with it or seasonal pillows to go with it so we're gonna try those out today you saw that horse ball I don't know if they'll blow that up I think we probably should ride today if we have a chance because it's supposed to be beautiful carve pumpkins I think I said everything else we needed to do I have a few other little things from Amazon just to show you I am y'all wearing I don't know if we're even focused here but I got my Lash Paradise uh, I got it from Amazon I'll link it for you below and I think it's always linked in beauty but I'll make sure the Lash Paradise is like a dupe for um, Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara and that mascara is so good and this Lash Paradise is too but they had it and I don't think I've tried this in black brown or brownish black or something I don't know and it looks almost black but it's just a little bit softer because I kept noticing um, when I did my makeup, my my um, mascara was so harsh. And I, you know, I'm trying to do like the autumn and the soft colors on my face and everything. So I'm loving that. Uh, anyway, I just got a few other little things that I'll show you when we get home. Also, uh, in other news, I didn't realize this, but Merritt's gonna be practicing twice a week for basketball. Um, and it actually works out because his, his day I knew about was Thursday and the other day they added was Monday nights, which Koi has practiced anyway. So hopefully that'll kind of coincide and we don't have to like have another night away from family time or just like being home and not having to do anything. Um, so we'll have them both practice Monday nights. Koi practice Saturday mornings. Merritt practices <laughs> Thursday afternoon or night and then I think December 3rd is Merritt's first game so then he'll be playing on Saturdays too so it's all good it's gonna be so fun it's gonna be a lot of time in this car for me so maybe I'll actually get some reading done <laughs> it's good y'all I like it a lot <laughs> all right basketball is done oh, for the no day water no water break Oh my goodness, torture. <laughs> okay, we are home and I have a random assortment of stuff. I did get some more of the 
Airwick refills. I'll put one in our room. I need to get some of the actual little, um, you know, like the little warmers, I guess they're called. I thought I had some for every room. I thought I switched everybody over because we were using the Febreze ones, but they don't ever have good sense. Um, now I say that and they probably will, but, um, anywho, I got those. I will link those in household is what it's called household. And then, um, I'll link them below too. It smells really good. I needed a new remote for the TV and the playroom. So I'll get that set up. I needed new phone chargers. I always like to keep one in my travel bag and keep one over there by my chair um, and did I tell you how I dyed stuff yesterday? Is that what I was saying? We showed Koi's costume. We had to dye the pants. Anyway, I dyed a few things. I'll show you those. Um, so I took one of those out and I'll put one in my travel bag and then just whatever. Um, Craig has an iPhone too, so he might need some cords. And then these are the pillowcases that I got. Y'all, they are so pretty and they match my chair so nicely. And y'all know I love a good pom-pom moment. So cute. I'm going to link them in household and I'll link them directly below too if you want to pick them, pick them up. But they uh, had lots of different colors. I just think this is so cute. In fact, I have this version of this pillow in red over there on my couch. I don't know if you can see it right there. Um... But, but bigger. These are just 12 by 12s because I thought that would be better. And then I did just get the, oh shoot, are these 16 or 12? Uh, they had to be 16, right? I hope I got the right size. Oh well, stay tuned. Anyway, I was thinking I got 12 by 12s. That looks like 12 too, but this is 16. Oh my goodness. I'm not going to open this. Well, I guess I can always return these for bigger ones. Um, we'll see. I'll open that all up and see. And then, um, that is Merritt's, uh, basketball shoes that just came in today too, but he is outside, um, uh, moving bales with Craig. Maybe we should go out there and see what they're doing. Is the Kubota up here, Koi? Ooh, it is. Maybe we'll ride out there. Um, Anyway, let me go back and see what I ordered for these pillowcases because I'm not going to open all of it up until I see what size I actually got. Okay, we did get the right size for everything, so I'm going to pop these open and then they'll just fluff right up and then we'll put the pillowcases on and see how they look in the mending room. All right, let's see. I need to also iron Merritt's patch back on here quick so that hopefully um, this afternoon we can take the pictures. But look, let me see if I can drop that on there. I mean, it's not perfect, perfect, but I love it. And I think it looks so good with the um, dot down here too. So I'm just going to kind of put them up here some way. I mean, Halloween is Monday, so I know my Christmas is coming right on out. So I'm not going to like style it with this yet because I have that other Christmas pillow that's going to look so cute in here. Oh my goodness. And then let's see, does this remote work? Oh yes, I saw the light come on. Woohoo! all right so i can i guess i'll just have to throw this one away they look almost the same except different little settings at the top i don't know anyway it wouldn't this one like wouldn't turn it on or make the volume work or anything so hopefully this new one works okay let me get these put on the window seat and we'll see how they look okay i just have them kind of in each corner right now <laughs> that looks so cute and then that um, Christmas pillow is going to look adorable with it too. I kind of, I'm kind of wishing I would have gotten bigger ones because I think that that Christmas pillow was bigger. But just for like every day, like when Halloween is over or when like, I don't think I'll find like a Valentine one to put up. How cute is that? I don't want to put it away. <laughs> I guess you could say it for um, Thanksgiving, but that's cute. Don't we think, let me try to back up here. I think it looks cute. And it's not like, I wish I would have gotten video of that window seat, but it was just like big and puffy and I don't know. I just didn't like the way it looked. So I am happy with that. And then if the boys want to sit over here, it's usually McCoy that sits over here. He's got like a little bit of cushion in the corner there. So, all right, those are a winner. I'm going to put them in household in case you want to check them out. And the inserts too, um, they're very affordable. Um, both inserts and the pillowcases. So I'll put them, I'll link them both below and put them both in the household, uh, little Amazon storefront. All right, the remote works. I found another little Halloween scene and you can hear the rain and the fire crackling. I can't wait. I just saw they do these for Christmas too. It's so fun. Anyway, um, I feel like I, I have done the Christmas one like fireplace before and had that on like um, when the boys woke up Christmas morning, I think. Anyway, it's just a fun little ambiance here because sometimes I can't like be over here crafting and like be paying attention to like a show, like Housewives, yeah, but like not like one of my shows like that. Medici. Medici that's what it is um that one I'm watching is so good like I cannot stop watching it it's so good um but like you have to watch because it's like very detailed um I'm trying to get over here by this light is that better I don't know. 
Um, so like I couldn't be watching that and crafting, uh, but it's kind of fun just to have like a little ambiance going on in here while I am crafting. So I don't know if I said that, but I did get Merritt's uh, thing ironed on. I think that'll work good, at least for one more day anyway and for a picture this afternoon. Um, and then Koizis is done. I think he'll just wear boots with it, I guess. It doesn't really matter. And uh, a wh white t-shirts for both of them underneath. So, I don't know if I said, but we did get, I think I showed y'all those. Koi just got some aviators too to go with his. They're different than Merritt, so they have a little bit of different character to their costume. Since McCoy is, put, or Merritt is supposed to be Maverick and Koi wants to be Iceman. So, <laughs> there we go. Um, all right, that is done. I don't know. I need to call Craig and see Hello, I'm down here at what they're planning like, if they're gonna come in for lunch or if we need to bring them something out. I'm sure they'll call me because they're just moving bales. Um, and maybe, I don't know, McCoy doesn't really wanna ride out there and I don't wanna go by myself, so he probably won't. We'll see. Coy, you wanna ride out to the field and see him? Not yet. Not yet, he keeps saying that. Anyway, uh, stay tuned. I don't know, maybe I'll go watch my show for a little bit. <laughs> I almost forgot I was gonna tell y'all about, let me turn this fan off, about this. Um, so I dyed McCoy's pants and they were already like a really khaki green. So we just kind of boosted the green up a little bit. And when I took these out, I noticed what a pretty like teal color the water was. And I was like, oh, let me throw this sweater in here. This is one that I got from Amazon that was honestly a fine fall color, but it was a little more on the blue side and I wanted it a little bit more teal, a little more Kingfisher. And so I stuck them in there for just a little bit. And I mean, it is the perfect Kingfisher color now. Oh my gosh, I absolutely love it. I got this one at the beginning of fall, like in August, like right away when we got home from mom and daddy's. So if you remember that one, I will, uh, it's a circle hem card or circle hem sweater. Like I love y'all know it's a little bit high low. I'll link it for you below. It's, it's not this color in person. It's just a little bit more blue, but it's still a good fall color. So I'll link it for you if you want to see it, but I just love how it turned out. It's so pretty. I love these sweaters, y'all. I'm going to live in them in a couple of weeks when it gets too cold for what I've been wearing. Um, and then this one was already kind of a navy color, and I stuck it in that teal just to try to teal it up a little bit. Uh, so, I mean, not a big change, but kind of. This is a huge change, but I don't love it because it kind of got like... I don't know if you can see that, like right there. It's sort of stained, and then it was a pretty teal color in the water, and when I pulled Rashi, it out, it kind of turned look, mint green. I told you, Okay, you just have a little <laughs> mushroom set up over there. Look, he's sitting on a mushroom. Anyway, um, so I don't know. I will probably re-dye this one somehow because it, like I said, it was a pretty teal color and then it turned mint green, which is not my shades at all, but it was white and navy before, which is not my shades, like not even a little bit. So I don't know. We'll see. It got like this weird, I don't know why that happened. If there was like a stain on it before I dyed it or something. Anyway, I love this is a Stitch Fix sweatshirt market in Spruce and it is so soft and so cozy and flattering. Like I love this sweatshirt. I hope I didn't wreck it, but maybe I just need to do it like something darker to hide these stains and then make it more of a fall color. But that is the dyeing that I did yesterday. Um, okay. Still don't know what's gonna happen next. Stay tuned. <laughs> We're all just scrounging yeah, around for lunch and a little bit of everything. We went to um, a steakhouse last night. And had left over, so I'm going to warm this up and make a little steak sandwich. But I had to show y'all these plates I got at Dollar General. They're like the big, you know, industrial whatever plates. Not the, like, party plates. But it's fall themed. How fun is that? I hope they do this for Christmas, too. It was like, what would, maybe I have one. Hang on. Here you go, because you know I got two packs worth. True living, everyday plates, and they're fall themed. I'm obsessed. All right, we forgot to do this this morning in all our haste. You only have one day left. What? We each get one. I got one. What is it? It's a teeny needle. Needle. It's. Mm. Oh, I like it. I like it. Here, here. What oh, color do you get, Koi? It's like one of those. It's, it's like a baseball. I got. I have a baseball. Wait, no. Remember the big pink one? Yeah, that, that got busted open. Yeah, it's Let a Let me mini. see, Koi. Just like a stress ball. I have one it too. It looks like a baseball. I have a purple one in my craft room that I stole out of this. We got, I picked this up, or the Great Pumpkin picked this up at um, Shields. Just like a little three pack, a little. Here, let me see it. Boy, they're very satisfying. Oh, you're going to do it? Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's yeah. like filled with sour cream, it looks like. <laughs> no, I hope it's not filled with sour cream. <laughs> oh, lovely. <laughs> they're taking a break from. Hard working farm work, moving bales to play. 
Big buck hunter. I'd rather work all day. Y'all better not kill a moose. They did that one time and I cried. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this TV is so idea. dirty. Oh my gosh. Look yeah, at it in the sunlight. Gross. Yeah, what are y'all hunting for? Frustration. I've got plenty. <laughs> oh my gosh. I want to see it. Here they go. Don't shoot the does. Mary, you're not even holding your gun up. That's what the dumb part is about this game. <laughs> All right, it's loud out here, but we got the <laughs> Dad, Dad, pepper, the stuff to carve. It's windy, and Craig put the table out. Oh goodness, this new setting is not gonna be good. Hang on, better. Craig got the table out of the horse trailer. We usually keep it, there's my shadow, in the trailer, um, just for like potlucks and stuff when we're showing horses. And then they are fixing to ride. How is this ball already so nasty? <laughs> Merritt's gotta go get on Sassy, but she needs to, he needs to give Rocky some hugging first. Cade likes to be back home, I think. <laughs> Let's mount it up. I think we'll go for a little trail ride and then we need to carve our pumpkins. You coming out? <laughs> here we go. They're moving bales over here. Not me trying to get everybody to go carve pumpkins and they're roping instead. <laughs> Merritt's trying to get his saddle off. Y'all, I hope this footage is good. I have no idea. Uh, I'm getting nervous that it's going to be all blurry. Ooh. He's a roping instructor now, y'all. <laughs> oh gosh. No one wants to carve pumpkins. They're just going to rope the rest of the afternoon, y'all. Why can't weather be like this like all year round? It is so perfect. It's a little windy, but like the weather is perfection. I feel like I'm so dark. I don't know. Is it too dark? <laughs> all right, Craig's helping Koi over here. Merritt is hard at work over here. This lighting is gonna be terrible, but it's warm over here. Merritt, Merritt your hand hurts? <laughs> you have like the prettiest pumpkin. Oh my goodness. Except for right here. Oh, well, just don't mind that. <laughs> yes! Yes! Oh my gosh, if you're an OG follower, do y'all remember when Mabel was a baby and we were carving pumpkins inside because it was so cold and we brought her in and took pictures with her and the pumpkins? Oh, memories. All right, Koi's going to town with his. Merritt is doing his with the expo marker. He just wants a big M. It's hard to see. So, here we go. I think Rocky is just eating all the pumpkin guts. He's working away on his M. Koizy finished his. Let's see, Koizy. Look how cute. Oh, it's so dark over here. Can we see it? Might have to get a better shot when we're up on the front porch. Oh! <laughs> My tree's gone, y'all. I think I said this on Instagram, but I did save a couple of the bigger pieces. That one out there and this one here that Craig's going to slice me some little slices. Um, like I have these here that I got from my daddy's ranch when they cut down a big tree there. My mama and daddy's ranch. But, um, I don't know. They're sentimental and I love to decorate with them. So, we're going to come take their picture over here on the step as always. I think they're coming on the <laughs> Kubota can't walk with our pumpkins, I guess. Where's yours, Sarah? Oh, Koi, you have yours there? All right, photo time. Isn't 
It's the boys of fall out here, y'all. <laughs> they are outside playing football. I mean, gorgeous day. <laughs> and I am in here changing batteries on their little pumpkin lights. They just throw these right down in their um, little jack-o'-lanterns. Although we have had these a couple of years and I'm scared they're not going to do as good. This one, there it is. They're a little glitchy. Uh-oh. Oh, there they go. All right, maybe they'll work tonight. I love driving up to the house when the jack-o'-lanterns are lit up. It's so fun. <sighs> okay, now that I am a crazy wind-blown mess, I'm gonna go relax for a little bit. It's four now. We don't have to meet my friend Mary and her little boy until seven. Uh, and I don't know, like, did I already say this, that Craig and McCoy are gonna go to the pumpkin patch? I'm not sure what time they're gonna go. I'm assuming we're just gonna eat out because... <laughs> I didn't prepare anything so I was thinking we would just take each boy um to get fast food or whatever before or after our little adventure and it's kind of fun because y'all know you follow me along like usually we do things either with me and the boys or Craig and the boys or all four of us together we rarely like separate them but it really is I mean we do separate them some especially like Koi sh goes shopping with me but it's fun to do like things separate with them too to get like those memories and just be able to listen to them and just have one-on-one -on -one time so that's what we're going to do tonight. They are cleaning up the pumpkin stuff now. I see them getting the hose and everything out. So that's great. We'll catch up soon. All right, y'all. Outfit change. We are heading to the scary whatever it is. I've just got my orange bag here. This is from Amazon. I can link this for you. It's a it's an exact dupe to Lululemon, except it doesn't have the little... Uh, I have an actual Lululemon one, and I'm telling you, it is an exact match. It just does not have the logo. Anyway, I have got, I'll show you the earrings in a minute. They're my big, um, what are these called? Jack-o'-lanterns, the things we just carved. My, um, vest that I wear all year round that I absolutely love. It's North Face. I got it from Stitch Fix. These jeans that I got from Stitch Fix the other day, just my Hey Dudes, um, and this little, this is a... Walmart sweatshirt, the ones that I love so much. Uh, I wanted to wear my boots. Oh, the earrings. I think these are from Shein or AliExpress. I've had them for a while. I wanted to wear my new Sperry's. I have been loving them. They are so comfortable and cozy, y'all, and they'd be perfect for tonight. But I wanted to wear this outfit because I just thought it would like, I wanted, I wanted, I wanted, I wanted. I definitely, let me see if we can get a better background so you can, you know, see the craft room. How about that? Uh, oh, there we go. Um, I wanted to wear this orange or some one of my little pouches like this. I have several um, and I thought orange would go best because I want my hands free and I want to have something to like put my phone and my money in and hopefully not get like <laughs> grabbed or torn or I don't know. I'm so scared. Anyway, so I kind of thought this up in my head because I wanted to do a vest because I'm not sure what the temp's going to be. It's so nice, but like when that sun goes down, it like start getting cold. So um, this is what we came up with. I don't really love the hey dudes with it, but that's really all I have right now to go with something like this. So. Halloween night when we go trick-or-treating maybe I'll wear my boots anyway I probably won't even get out of the car so it doesn't matter anyway they put their lights in their pumpkins hopefully we can show you those when we drive up tonight um and hopefully I make it back to this house y'all I'm getting scared we're gonna go grab something to eat and then we're going all right I lost an earring it's in my purse it just like came apart y'all that was scary <laughs> Oh my gosh, and everybody was like, it's not scary, you'll be fine. I was terrified. They had this one thing that was called a rat enclosure and you had to crawl through it. And like once you got to the end, like I could not get out. And so it was like, like you couldn't touch, like the characters couldn't touch you and you couldn't touch them. And at the end, like there was this man, like Freddy Krueger or whatever standing there. And I was like, help me. And he just looked at me and I was like, no, for real, I can't get out of here. And, and then he held me up. Like, I wasn't stuck. I just couldn't, like, figure out how, like, was I just gonna, like, keep crawling out onto the ground? Or, like, how was I gonna get, like, standing back up? Oh, my God. And then I was, like, crawling on rats. Like, oh, no thank well, you. Well, they, they were under glass. They were under plexiglass, but still, you were, like, crawling on rats. It was so gross. What was your worst part, Merit? The bus driver. The bus driver. You had to walk through an old school bus with, like, people... It was. And then the Let's quit talking driver, about it or we're not going to be able to sleep. The bus driver had a white face mask and his eyes were bulging out. Are you going to want to do it again next year? Yeah. <laughs> I was hoping he'd say no. Okay, y'all. Does your head hurt? No. Oh. It's just for mental issues. <laughs> mental issues. 
what have I done to my child? Uh, like, we both decided that we were glad that we did not let McCoy go because I don't he, think he, he wouldn't have made it through that school bus. We would have had to take him back. <laughs> it was so scary. It was so scary. I just cannot. I didn't know you were going to have to, like, walk through stuff. I thought it was going to be, like, all out in the open. No. Oh, they gave you, um, little glow sticks. Okay. Enough about that. I'm going to go show you the, um... Jack lanterns outside because they're all lit up and they look so cute. And now I'm gonna go get into my cozy PJs, take these earrings off or this one earring off, and go to bed. Oh, McCoy and Craig went to Mexican and then we called them and they were still eating and they had not even gone to the pumpkin patch yet because McCoy wanted to go in the dark. So we said, Well, do you want us to meet you at the pumpkin patch at the corn maze? And McCoy was like, No. And so we're like, Okay, we're going home. So anyway, they're still out and about having fun. Um, I'm gonna end it here, y'all. Thanks so much for following me along. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a thing. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all.